I've got two items on my shopping list this week. Whether we get them or not, that's another question. The first one is our fourth Zenite shard, so we can complete our Zenite jewellery. At the Demonic Gorillas, we haven't had the best of RNG. Uh, we're currently pretty dry. Pretty, pretty dry. It took us 1300 KC to get our first, and uh, our second and third came relatively shortly after-ish. Uh, but yeah, we're up to like 2200 KC now, still trying to get our fourth Zenite. And the other item, which if you've been following the series recently, is that Bando's chest plate. Find out how we got on after the intro. After the loss of my hardcore Iron Man status, a new adventure is born. Carrying on from where I left off, without the fear of death looming overhead, there's no holding back. This is Dead Smithy, and welcome to my Iron Man progression series. Hello everyone, my name is Smithy, and welcome back to the Iron Man progression series. Oh, we are carrying on, carrying on the, the fun that we are having at Bandos this week. Uh, if you've been following the series, you know that it took us a little while for us to get our first drop. Uh, we're about 350 something KC at the moment, and uh, we're pushing on, pushing, pushing on to try and get the last item we need, which is the Bandos chest plate. We've managed to get the tacits, the boots, and last episode we managed to get the hilt, completing a BGS, which is huge. Uh, and also, again, if you saw last episode, you know that I said that I'm all steam ahead on farming. Uh, as we're pushing towards getting to uh, 94 farming there. Um, yeah. We want 99 this year. And to do that, we need to uh, stick, stick to our farm runs, our trees, our fruit trees and our herbs and all of the other stuff like farming contracts. So we'll be doing a lot of that this week, trying to push towards another level. We're also working on fletching as well as we're trying to get that 99 this year as, uh, on top of that. And, um, yeah, I think, we, you know, I know I said in the intro, we're working on the Zenite as well. Um, Demonic Gorillas, we're kind of doing when the server is a little bit iffy uh, and we can't do the altar door method at Bandos. Uh, but I think there's rumours within the clan that we might head over to Callisto as a big group and, uh, you know, try and farm some drops there. Uh, I've not done Callisto before. I've done RTO, if you see my guide, you know I got fairly spooned there uh, to get our Void Waker hilt. Um, but yeah, haven't done any Callisto before, so looking forward to that. But um, let's get on with the game. Enough, 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 enough yapping from me. Let's get on with it. All right, I want to try out the BGS at um, Hesporin. Let me quickly put up. Oh, actually, there's one still over there. Bang. There we go. Let's pray mage. A 40. Okay, what about with the spec? Nice, we missed. <laughs> Go on. Nice, we missed again. All right, already love the BGS. Love it. We did kind of shred through Hasbori there. I don't think that's a new PB. No, five seconds. But 50kc now at Hasbori. All right for the old leaderboards, I guess. What are we going to get? Come on, Tangle Root, please. No Tangle Root, but <laughs> we go again. All right, I think we're going to get one of those virtual levels again. Yeah, there we go. 102 range coming in. How much XP is that now? Just over 17 and a half mil. Nice. All right, down he goes again. Chest plate, chest plate, chest plate. Snap dragon, snap dragon, snap dragon. I know I'm not on task, but I'm going to go and do some uh, demonic gorillas. We still need one more Zenite, and that will be a tile on the board as well if we get that finished off. But if we go on Glau's experiments... That's how our log is looking. <laughs> 2,148 and we've had three Zenites. I think it was like 13 or 1,400 KC for our first, which is pretty mad. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we can close out the four, or the set of four, pretty soon. And uh, yeah, wish me luck. So with the Void Waker spec, it's actually pretty lit because you can force him to change to protect from uh, Mage with the spec. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sick. All right, I've got to record this quick because I've just turned my fan off so I can actually record and it not go in your ears. Um, so before I melt, because again, my office is the temperature of the sun, uh, I did 54 demonic gorillas. Yes, we want to get ourselves a our final Zenite shard, but also they're pretty good for money. 54, 940k. I mean, that's not too shabby, Alonso, is it? Because the Bank of Smithy, in coins' sake, I mean, not the actual value, the coins are not looking too good at the moment. So, some alcables, some other bits and pieces. 
can we take that? Right, I think this might be a PB. It felt quick. Oh, it's two seconds. I tell you what, I got caught on... I got snared as I was killing these two last uh, flowers. But anyway, I think this might be a level. I can't remember how much XP Naspori gives. Okay, not quite enough. Let me, let, let me, let me go on a health check a tree. So I have been on my best behaviour. I have been going and doing my tree runs. Primarily fruit trees. I do find it quite annoying with uh, trees where, um, you know, they they the one below a level, so like a palm tree, for example, you use pa papaya for, is it pineapple or papaya? What, well, evil or? It's the tree below's fruit that you use to protect the one above. Um, and I just seem to burn through all of mine. <laughs> uh, but anyway, if we do this, there is 94 farming. Please. Could you get that board up? Please, could you update that farming progress? We're one step closer to another 99, and one step closer to another green tile on that bingo board. And also, if you are new to the series, uh, we are doing a year-long bingo on the account that's slowly building blocks for us to progress further into the realm of PVM and also towards maxing. We've already got a lot of things checked off that list, which you love to see. But uh, yeah, there's still still a lot of things we need to do. Right, we are back at the wonderful Bone Shard Mines. Um, we've done another solid shift. Uh, using the Dragon Pickaxe as well is just elevating the uh, XP we're getting per hour. But of course, I'm AFK in a lot of this while I'm working on the hardcore video. Um, here's how the stats are looking. We've gained we've got we've gained 150k pretty much XP. We still need 393k until the next level. Um, yeah. Slow and steady, as they say. <laughs> um, but yeah, 92 is going to really help out. Well, 91, because we can boost for longer. Uh, but 92 especially is going to help us with a fletching grind, which is mainly why I'm doing this, so we can get amethysts properly unlocked. Uh, and uh, also it means we can stock up a little bit of prayer XP as well, as we're still only 87 prayer, and it would be good to get that towards 90. But obviously, that's not what we're doing at the moment that's not the main focus it's just a little side quest hell yeah all right so i'm still running barrows on the hardcore at the moment as you can see and uh that means that i've done some more mining um yeah I, I, i'm over 10 hours now this, for this week um <laughs> i was gonna go and do something else but Barrows isn't giving the goods on the hardcore, so I'm stuck here until that happens. But, you know, we're making progress in mining, so can't complain. All right, we're sending some mass Callisto. I've never actually done Callisto really before. This this will be like my first KC. Um, uh -oh. But as you know, I've done RTO before. We've already got the hilt. Um, yeah. Just all, all the all the gang we've we've gone we've gone on a little trip, you know. I totally haven't been PK'd already before even getting a kill. No, no, no. Oh, and Bear is trying to get me. <laughs> you ever you ever feel trapped in a corner? <laughs> That's me right now. That is me right now. Oh dear. I'm fighting for me little life. Yeah. See you later. What do we get? Dragon bones, go on. Is that one KC? It is. Nice. All right, there we go. There's two KC. Dark crabs, hell yeah. We need food, so we'll take some dark crabs. And the respawn time on this thing is mad. Like, as I hit stop recording after that, it spawned again. I think they changed the respawns on the uh, the larger bosses in the wilderness, which is really, really good because it means you can just rinse through kills. All right, what do we reckon? Pet? Go on, I dare you. Oh no, but there's a challenge for doing something. <laughs> oh, super restores, lovely. And see, look, it's already respawned. <laughs> this is mad. And if you're interested in my setup here, this is what I'm using. Um, I tell you what, MSB is actually doing bits, especially with the spec, which is really, really nice. Um, yeah. And with that, there's another KC. I think that's number four. Room picker. Yeah, love that for me. Like I need any more room pickaxes. All right, 5kc. Coconuts, that's good. We need that for our farm runs. All right, bloody hell. Callisto has hands, man. <laughs> Let's go and bank. And oh, I see I've got pk Literally just about to hit the line to be able to get out of there. 
All right. Ooh, Snapdragon seeds. Go on. We like those. I'm not debating getting them home, but anyway, I haven't got a looting bag, so. <laughs> As if, back to back seeds. More um, Two Renard seeds. Go on. Please, can I get these home? <laughs> I don't want to leave already, but yeah, I want to get these home. All right, 9kc. Cannonballs. Why? <laughs> All right, we're back. A room 2h for our troubles. Fair enough. What do you reckon, pet? No, nope, uncut dragonstone. Fair All more super stores. Yeah, get rid of those caramb ones. I'm trying to stock up on them. <laughs> oh, more Renard seeds. Yeah, love that. And I did manage to get the last seeds home because I died here. So it means it was in my death, uh, death's waiting room. <laughs> Go on then. Oh, more Snapdragons as well. Love that. Love it. Love everything about that. Hey, that's not bad either. Ring kite shield. Go on. Alcables, Alcables, we take those. Especially the fact that my account is incredibly poor uh, in sort of cash at the moment. <laughs> Hence why I've not been doing my kingdom. Never got the spare money to do it. Oh, and actual super restores as well, nice. Oh, and they're noted. Oh, that is so good. <laughs> 20kc, even more snapdragons. Right, I'm getting them home. I'm getting them home. Oh, bloody hell. We were just joking about getting a hilt and I get bloody green text red D hide. Fair enough. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. Oh, and I'm trapped. I trapped my literally trapped myself. Yeah, nice. Fucking nailing it. Yep, 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 yep. Maybe expect the unexpected. Trap yourself. <laughs> oh, and no, I'm dead. <laughs> Yay! Yeah! Ooh, woo! How much is that worth? 264. Ah, well. But we did end up with 28 KC. Uh, here's how the loot's looking for that. 1.2 mil, pretty much. Uh, obviously, some of that didn't get home, and some of it I left on the floor because it's, you know... I don't want it. <laughs> like, I don't need 150 mahogany logs. I've already got like a few thousand, tens of thousand in the bank that I've not done anything with. So 150 ain't going to go and miss. Uh, but anyway, um, oh, actually, I need to drop my cape off because I keep it in my house. Anyway, fun little trip that. Right, is this going to be a PB? It did feel fast. No, <laughs> nowhere near anyway. Come on, Tangle Root. Oh, four qualms though. Nice. I don't think anyone has ever got excited over qualms before. Actually, thinking about it, that's the least thing that I need at the moment, qualm seeds. All right, we've got two clues. We're still on the hunt for the bare feet and the sandwich lady bottoms for the beginner clues to finish off that tile on our bingo board. That one's not going to do it. But anyway, can the medium save us? Oh, wow. Wow, I don't even know what to say to that. I'm just... Fair enough. Hey, and there's a hard casket. Right, let's uh, eat a bit of this and open sesame. Oh, okay, cool. Anyway, I did lose all of my black dehyde chaps uh, in the wilderness, so I guess we got those back. <laughs> and here's the elite that I had hiding in my bank as well. Come on, don't let us down like the others. Oh, my God. I guess we've got a master to do now. Oof. 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 Just, just awful. <laughs> I think we're using up our luck on all good stuff rather than, uh, you know, some fun clue stuff. All right, we're back at Bando's. I've already gone through all my food on this trip. Going really well, as you can tell. Uh, but I brought my blowpipe this time because then I can spec on the uh, major and hope that I get a little bit of a <laughs> hit points back. Anyway, wish me luck. And Bando's falls once again. Hell yeah. And a loop half of a key. It's not what we came here for. Might just leave it on the ground, to be honest. All right, here we go again. Ooh, it's the scam plate body. Don't really love that. All right, here we go again. 370. Oh, naughty at Christmas. Naughty at Christmas. Right, 372. 
Oh, what is it? Am I on, am I on Bando's uh, naughty list or something? But if you're on your around here and you don't know about the uh, log that we got so far at Grador, yeah, we've had the Tacits, Boots, and the Bando's Hill. We've got a full uh, blade as well. So, um, yeah, we've got a BGS, but we're looking for that chest plate. That is the main thing we're looking for now. All right, whew, shaky end of the year. <laughs> that one but all that for bus ride home oh and i'm dead nice <laughs> right so we're burning through all of our food so i'm gonna take some time to uh catch some sharks i'm doing minnow fishing because it's like the easiest way to get sharks from what i know so uh yeah gonna spend an hour or two here stock up and uh then we'll go back to bandos yeah maybe hopefully please can we get that bandos chest plate soon just so we can wrap that boss up, move on to bigger and better things, and also check off another square on that bingo board. But anyway, see ya, see you in a bit. All right, we're back at Bandos. We're back with a <laughs> scam pickaxe. Nice, yep, cool. All right, slight change of plans. Um, yeah, I'm getting a bit of server lag tonight, so... Bandos isn't an option, unfortunately. So I'm, I'm, what I'm going to do is we're going to go back to Demonic Gorillas. We're going to hope that we can get ourselves our final Xenite. Uh, if we look at Glau's experiments. We've got three. 2,202kc. Please, please, can we finish off this Xenite set? Uh, I know I don't have a uh, task at the moment, but that's fine. It doesn't really matter. Um... Yeah, we just got to go and uh, get some more kills on the board. I tell you what, all of this PVM we've been doing lately, we are stocking up on Snapdragon Seeds and Renards. We just got two more from the uh, Demonics, which is nice because I just uh, planted my last ones that I had. So, um, yeah, we can go and do, uh, you know, go and plant some more, get some more Snapdragons. We're up to uh, like 200 odd um, restores now as well, which is mad. I don't think I've ever had that many. Uh, which might not seem like a lot, but when you're burning through them, it's nice that you're, you know, replenishing them nearly as quickly as you're using them. You know, that's kind of a <laughs> the aim of the game, especially as an Iron Man. Uh, but anyway, we're, uh, we've done, I don't even know how many we've done. I can, I can check in a minute uh, because I've killed enough that my aggro has been lost, which is good because it means it's a bit chiller. You've not got to uh, be on your toes every time you finish a kill. And there we go. There's another one down. Turn that off. A couple of prayer pots. But I'm out of food, so I might teleport out. Oh, no, nope, maybe my aggro has re-aggroed. It does do that here, which is a little bit annoying. Um, but while I've got you, Glau's experiments. We've done 24, which doesn't seem like a lot, but we've not been here that long. And don't forget as well, I'm looking uh, for lovely alcohols on this as well, uh, which we are getting a nice amount of. Because the Bank of Smithy, coin-wise, is looking a little bit low. Right? We had green text a few weeks ago. Now, now we're, you know, <laughs> getting down to near no mills in the bank. What I did forget to bring, though, is my Ash Sanctifier, which whenever I mention the Ash Sanctifier, there's always someone who doesn't know what it is. Uh, it works exactly like a bone crusher. It, instead, it automatically scatters ashes for you, so you get some passive prayer XP, which is really nice. Otherwise, I just leave it on the floor. So to give you an idea of our luck here, so we've had three Zenites, right? Um, the drop rate on the Zenite is one in three hundred. We've killed roughly two thousand three hundred. So in theory, we should have had seven Zenites because, you know. Um, 2300 divided by 300 divided by 300 is 7.66666 recurring so yeah we we uh <laughs> i guess we all have to go dry somewhere uh if you can really call that dry i mean we've actually seen zenites but i think it was 1300 something like that for us to get our first one uh, i'm sure someone cor can correct me on that if you uh remember back then when i got my first one um but yeah Demonic Gorillas haven't been our friends. We've got <laughs> loads of ballista pieces, but um, who really uses a ballista if you're not PK and really? I mean, does anyone actually use a ballista? No. Um, yeah. Xenites haven't come thick and fast here, but then you look at other places where 
other other people go dry like corrupted gauntlet and <laughs> yeah let's maybe not talk about those sort of places and uh <laughs> our luck but um yeah like i said we've all got to go dry somewhere i'm gonna hit him with a big old void waker spec because we can force them to start praying protect from mage and then we just go ha 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 i lied it's a melee attack also where we are on our fletching grind at the moment as well uh, it is nice that these drop um, javelin heads and also javelin shards, uh, shards, shafts, um, because you can kind of like tick make um, javelins while you're here. So, you know, get a little bit of fletch and XP on the side of hunting for that last Zenite. So, yeah, we're, we're, we're trying to maximize our gains while, you know, doing fun little grinds like demonic gorillas but um yeah i've not got any uh shafts yet but i do have some javelin dragon uh, drag drag what, what the hell did i just say <laughs> dragolin javelin heads <laughs> no, i don't think that's a word oh what am i doing um dragon javelin heads um i always fuck up when i'm talking uh which is normally why i don't record while i'm doing these because concentration to the max you know how it is uh, but yeah, like I'm saying, you uh, you get rune and dragon javelin heads here, so um, you can kind of make them while, uh, while you're killing away. Oh yay, another light frame. I think that's what, number eight or nine or something like that. We'll check after, but man, I did not want to see another light frame before another Zenite. I'll show you what I mean about uh, using javelins or using javelin heads while we're out here. Take that, and while you're doing that, switch your uh, <laughs> switch your weapon. Oh, he's attacking. All right, let's quickly switch. Do that again. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> there you go. See what I mean? You can make some javelins while you're killing these things. All right, how many light frames is that now? Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, boom, boom. Glau's experiments. Nine. <laughs> and what drop rate is a light frame? Light frame, OSRS. It, it, oh, no, light sources, light frame. It is a 1 in 750. So we can get nine of those in 2000, nearly 300 KC, but we can only get three Zenites, which is a lower drop rate. And heavy frames, so, so we're, you know, we know what we're looking at here. A light, a heavy frame is a one in fifteen hundred. We've got four of them. Uh, the blister limbs is a one in five hundred. We've got three of them, and the spring is a one in five hundred, and we've got three of them as well. Little old zenites, one in three hundred. You do the maths. That is insane. Right, I'm bringing alks with me now, which means I can now alk while I'm uh, on the mission. <laughs> uh, but yeah, still going. We're just over uh, the. 2300 mark now so i'm hoping i'm hoping i'm hoping i'm hoping i'm hoping we can get that zenite shard soon uh because i do want to go back to bandos this episode uh the servers have been way better than they were yesterday so i i really want to get back there and you know keep pushing for that bandos chest plate but you know why not get both upgrades why not why not do both hey eh? why not why not get both of them why not have another huge week and get a couple of upgrades because uh, we've not really got anything this week so far. So um, <laughs> for the sake of your guys' entertainment, I hope we get something. <laughs> right, it's probably not going to do it while I'm recording, but if I use the Void Waker spec, it normally hit... Yeah, of course it doesn't. Uh, <laughs> it has been hitting like 50s and 60s, which means you instantly shift the um, def defensive prayer that the uh, gorilla is using, which is really, really sick because it means you can quickly switch back to uh, the style that you've been, you know, shedding off a load of damage with. Works really, really well. It's really nice. And also it's good for uh, sort of finishing off a gorilla as well. So when it's down to, you know, 40 hit points, smack it with a Void Waker spec and good night, my friend. Please can I have a Zenite? Normally it's no, but um, you always have to ask politely, right? Right, going to take a little pause from Demonic Gorillas. Uh, on, if you want to see the log, look at that. We've only got 790 on here for some reason. Um... Yeah, 48.1 mil worth of loot. Not too bad, but you know. We do have three Zenites, but it's only got two on here at the moment. 
Um, yeah, <sighs> this place. <laughs> The Monte Grillos, this place is just weird RNG for me. Really, really weird. But uh, anyway, I'm going to go and do some bandos. Yeah, let's go do some bandos. All right, we're back at bandos. There is a little bit of lag, but I'm, I'm just going to roll with it. And we're just going to roll with the punches. We've got a bus ride home already. Happy days. 375KC. Right, what I'll do is I'll, I'll include the full clip of this one, I think, so you can see the huge lag spike that was in the middle. Like, I mean, like, the game just froze for a good, like, five seconds. <laughs> Thankfully, um, Bandos didn't capitalise on that, and he just used range attacks, and I was praying range. But anyway, 377kc. Oh, I can feel that, that, that chest plate, man. It's around the corner. It's, it's on its way. I can feel it. Right, that felt like a really quick kill. Ah, there's the scan plate body, but 32 seconds. Whew. Right, 380. Come on, man. Oh, it's another scan plate body. All right, 381. Ooh, Snapdragon seed. Like to see those. Like I said, all this PVM is giving us seeds. We'd love to see it. All right, 383, I think this is. Yeah. Oh, Rune Longsword, all right, fair enough. Hey, I missed the pop-up, but there is 101 magic coming in. Very nice. Uh, I know I mentioned a couple of episodes about, about virtual levels, and uh, some of you guys seem to uh, like that addition, so it's here to stay. Uh, but yeah, 101, that means we're now on just shy of 16 mil magic xp which is kind of crazy and that was another speedy speedy kill magic logs 37 seconds that one and i am planning to do a runescape for dummies episode on bandos um it's just where the lag's been so bad i don't really want to record a guide where you know the gameplay is all over the place and it doesn't really get a give a good representation of how to do the fight I want to wait until, you know, everything's kind of calmed down a bit service-wise, which hopefully is soon, because, you know, I'm off work at the moment, and I was planning on knocking out the guide and <laughs> getting it up for Friday. Um, but no, but no. Tell you what, Bandos hasn't really dropped any super stores this trip, and by not many, I mean none at all. So, We're only going to maybe get 13kc a trip. What? All right, Bandos falls, 387 run out of run energy on that one as well all that for some adamant ore wow and if you're wondering the tracker is looking like that all right bandos down you go again mate 390 i think yeah but a rune long sword it's not quite it is it it's not quite what we're looking for right 392 silver ore i'm pretty sure that's rare drop table Oh man. <laughs> Alright, 394. Let's get the blowpipe out and spec. Nice spec. Not so nice rune longsword. Alright, 397. Bah, nature runes. It doesn't even give that many as well. 69. <laughs> Alright, 399. Another scam pickaxe, mate. Come on, we get enough of those in the wilderness. And there is the big 400kc. Come on, anything? No, no, some, some nature runes. All right, fair enough. I'm going to kill this major and then I'm going to telly out, I think. We're out of uh, st uh, super stores, which is a little bit annoying, but is what it is. Right, and I think that is going to do it for this week's episode. Um, yeah, I mean... <laughs> progress is progress right i mean we're progressing really well in the uh skills that we're looking to get 99 this year especially farming we're up to 94 now we're pushing forward with fletching as well the big thing at the moment is gathering the supplies that we need for fletching um i've kind of got some ideas of where we could get some uh resources from but if you've got any suggestions please do let me know uh, i think we're going to need some money uh to go and buy broad 
bolts and all that sort of stuff. Um, but yeah, I've also got in mind of I've got like thirty four thousand flax that I need to uh, turn into bowstrings. So I'm thinking of using the spell, but I think that's going to take bloody ages. Currently banked, we have ninety five fletching with all the uh, bows that I have unstrung. We just need to string them. Uh, it's going to take a long, a little, a little while. It's going to take a long while to get that done. Um, but yeah, we're moving and grooving in the right direction. But anyways, if you are new around here, please do consider subscribing. Drop a like. Comment of the episode is where's my Zenite. Uh, or if you don't want to comment that, let me know what you're currently working on in your accounts. How was your week? What did you get up to? Any drops? Um, are you dry anywhere? Are you getting spooned anywhere? I'd love to hear it. I always uh, find it really interesting reading everyone's uh, updates in the comments as well. Um, and yeah, a shout out to all of our channel members of Uncut Gameplay, Steve, Super Beef Made, AJ, Helena, Thamescape, Rayleigh, Chair, Raw, Johnny, Heathen, Celestine, Snotbones, Emma, Angry Mountain Gorilla, Joshua, and the Red Towed Selfie Hawk. Thank you for the continued support from the membership program. If you want to get involved with that and get a shout out at the end of the videos, there's a join button down below and uh, you can get all the details there. If you do want to support the channel, we've got the merch store as well. If you want to go and pick yourself up some sick Smithy TV threads, uh, links to that will be in the description. And uh, yeah, I'm going to stop rambling. Love you and leave you. Hopefully next episode I'll be a happy boy because England will be through to the next round of the uh, Euros. If not, um, shock, not. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, stay safe and I'll see you all very soon. Bye.